Trump was right about DAGA, Democrats panic after damning truth about Dreamers exposed. There has been plenty said about DACA. The Obama-era policy has allowed a significant number of illegal immigrants to stay in the United States. Democrats are fighting tooth and nail to save it. They are even willing to shut down the government, just to have their way. However, a new report shed some light on the kind of people protected by DACA, and it's an eye-opener that, no doubt, has Democrats feeling more than just a little panicked. The Obama administration was hell-bent on protecting illegals. Today, Democrats continue to desperately prop up the former president's failed agenda. They claim they simply want to help people in need. In reality, they need illegal immigrants. Democrats exploit illegals, promising them government handouts in exchange for loyalty, and votes. We all know illegal immigration has to end. While some illegals simply want to work and live in peace, many do not. Illegal immigration allows violent criminals into the country. They take advantage of our weak immigration enforcement. Drug dealers, crooks, murderers, and rapists are able to come to America, and stay. A new report has revealed that DACA-aged illegals commit significantly more crime than citizens of the same age. It has been proven that illegal aliens are not interested in following U.S. laws. The real kicker is that most of their victims are Hispanic or black. DACA-aged illegals commit crimes at twice the rate of young Americans, says a comprehensive summary of crimes and convictions in Arizona during the past 32 years. The report punctures claims by pro-amnesty advocates that young dreamer illegals are vital to U.S. industry and civic life, and indicate that any amnesty will ensure that many more crimes, including murders and rapes, will be inflicted against Americans and legal immigrants, including Hispanics and blacks. DACA age eligible undocumented immigrants are 250% more likely to be convicted of crimes than their share of the population. Those too old for DACA status are convicted at a relatively low rates. Source, Breitbart. The very people Democrats want to protect are committing a huge share of crime. It's not a surprise. These are people who came to the U.S. illegally. They were told no matter what they did, they could stay. DACA recipients grew up with a sense of entitlement. They were never taught to respect the laws of the land, nor the people who live here. Why wouldn't many of them violate other U.S. laws? Unsurprisingly, immigrants who come to America legally are far less likely to commit a crime. Imagine that. Illegal immigrants are being convicted at very high rates compared to their share of the population. Legal immigrants appear to be fairly law-abiding and are convicted at low rates compared to their share of the population. Source, Breitbart. It's also important to note that the victims of these crimes are often within the same ethnic group. Illegals often live in communities made up of people of the same nationality. So, those who suffer the most from their crimes are the same people Democrats claim to care so much about. The database used for the report does not describe the race or ethnic identity of the victim, but national data shows that most victims are part of the same group as their criminals. What tends to happen across all the different racial groups is that criminals are of the similar race as the victim. The crime literature shows that victims tend to be similar to the perpetrators of the crimes. Obviously, a larger share of the victims will also be undocumented illegal aliens. Source, Breitbart. Democrats who protect criminals through DACA and sanctuary cities are literally hurting them at the same time. When they provide shelter for criminals, they are enabling more crime to be committed against Hispanics, blacks, and other ethnic groups. Time and again, the left has crowed about how they put minorities first. Yet, the facts always show that their policies actually hurt minorities. They can call President Donald Trump racist all they want but his steps to restore the economy, improve national security, and end illegal immigration will help everyone more than the left's disastrous plans. It's clear that illegal immigration is a national security issue. Many illegals commit violent crimes. The people of this country are in direct danger when these criminals are not apprehended and deported. DACA and other policies that protect illegals will only lead to more pain, bloodshed, and death. Perhaps that's what Democrats really want. They want.